Hello friends, uh, today I am going to show you how to change the password of admin user if you forgot. So friends, you can see here we are trying to log in but our system is not allowing us to log in because we uh, are entering our wrong password or we forgot our password. So what we will do is we will restart our system and uh, boot with uh, boot our system with a bootable Windows 10 DVD or a bootable Windows 10 pen drive. So here we have restarted our system and inserted a bootable pen drive. Now we will press F9 to select the bootable media and we'll select the OS version here Here we got the uh, installation window. We have to press on next and press on repair option. Here we will select troubleshoot option. And we have to select command prompt over here. Type reg edit. Select H key local machine. Click on file and load hive. Now you have to open the uh, drive where your OS is installed. and you have to open windows system 32 and then config folder So here in config folder, you have to open or double click on system file. You have to set a name here for created folder. Now expand H key local machine. expand folder 1 2 3 4 which we created expand setup double click on cmd line at the right side and enter the value cmd.exe Now select setup type and change the value from 0 to 2. Select folder 1, 2, 3, 4 again which we created. Then file and then unload hive. Press on yes to proceed.
now go to file and then exit and now we have to exit from all the windows which are open now we have removed our bootable pen drive and will boot system normally you will get a command prompt window automatically or if you don't get it you can press shift f10 type net user and then press enter this command will show you all the users which are created in your system now you have to type net user then your user which is administrator space star shift plus f8 and then enter now system is asking you to enter the new password here so you have to type your new password now system is asking to retype your new password so you have to retype the new password again now your system password has changed so you have to exit from here now you can log in your system with new password which you have just entered or reset Now you can see your system has logged in with the new password.